What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Trick Tutorial Tuesdays, the series on my channel where every Tuesday I have two videos to break down tricks that you guys request or tricks in general. Now, in these two videos I'm uploading today, we're actually not going to go over tricks, we're going to be going over concepts. And actually some pretty basic concepts that I've seen a lot of you guys at Tranga ask me to do. So, the next couple trick tutorial videos still might be some beginner stuff, but what I'm trying to tell you is we're pretty much done with all the beginner stuff. All the beginner concepts, all beginner knowledge, and most of the beginner tricks. And now we're going to start moving up in advanced tricks for these trick tutorial videos that you guys request. I know, it's pretty exciting. But today we're actually going to be moving just, just a little bit to the left. Hold up. Alrighty, so here we are. This is the mini Changa half pipe. Of course, in this room there's a little bit of a skate park here. You might not have even known about this. But today what we're going to be looking at is how to drop into a ramp. That's right. Just the basic concept of how to drop in. Now there's multiple ways you can do it. You can do it from a 50-50. You can drop straight in. You can do it from a feeble. You can do it from a smash. It's kind of up to you. There's multiple ways, but I'm going to be going over how to drop in in general. So, the main thing I can tell you about dropping in is that you want to have your body weight completely centered on the scooter. You don't want to be leaning too far forward. You don't want to be leaning too far back. Because if you're too far back, you're going to slam your head against the quarter. And if you're too far forward, you're going to slam your head against the ground. So, center your weight. And when you're actually dropping in, you want to have a good foot stance. Now, I'm going to be doing the drop in of just normally going into the quarter pipe. No feeble smith, anything like that. I'm just kind of dropping right in, front wheel over coping, but essentially what I want to do is I want to get on my scooter, get on my comfortable foot stance, like the normal stance that you guys are going to be riding in all the time, what you're most comfortable with, and from there you're going to just kind of want to almost lean yourself in, kind of slowly inch a little bit to just, you know, kind of get your weight distributed to going into the quarter pipe, and from there you want to make sure your hands and your arms, they're pretty much, I'm not going to say locked, but you want to get them ready, because you don't want to drop in and then start to go nuts, turn and then die, you want to drop in, stay confident with your arms in the direction you're going so you can drop in and continue to go and so I'm gonna strap my helmet because it's getting crazy in here but essentially I'm gonna get on my scooter get my good foot stance get my arms ready so my wheels pointing forward and then pretty much I'm in a confident stance I'm ready to drop in I'm gonna lean forward and distribute my weight properly and I'm gonna drop in and roll away real good now of course this half pipe is probably not even three feet so it's a pretty easy place to drop into and a good place to practice now for the kids who don't have Changer around you're gonna have to find your own quarter pipe to drop into anything that you feel comfortable with I've seen some kids start off and drop right into vert walls and I've seen some kids who are scared about it so I'm making this video for the people who need to understand how to drop in and what to do and show you guys that it's not that scary as long as you do it right so whatever quarter pipe you have at your local skate park find the one that you're comfortable with preferably a smaller one so you can practice the drop in get it down get your confidence levels up and then from there start to rise up into the bigger quarter pipes and to the bigger attractions in the skate park and so yeah I guess I'll just do a couple more drop just to show you guys some examples I'm getting my foot stance ready I'm a little bit over coping and then once I'm ready, I'm just going to slowly kind of inch my way in, get ready, and steer. And so hopefully this video helped you guys out. Comment down below if this did help you guys out with how to drop in. Make sure to drop a fat like in the video. It helps me and the channel out. And subscribe and turn on post notifications because videos come out of this channel every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. So you don't want to miss those. And this has been How to Drop In with your boy John Cross. And until next time, I'll see you guys in the next Trick to Tutorial Tuesday. Peace.